Hey y'all, this is your K-pop auntie Carly, and I'm going to start doubling down on my requests. I am officially caught up on all of the AT's discography. Finally got through it all. Um, I didn't do the uh, Ode to Joy version of uh, Answer because... Was it Answer? No. Anyways, because... Um, I was watching it over on Kingdom Legendary War on Patreon, and dude, that was a friggin' rocker. <laughs> that was epic. Um, but what I do have is I have split my request from you guys into a few different categories. One is for stuff that has nothing to do with music, besides it being from 80s. Um, the other is... Uh, my Friday requests are going to continue to be things like uh, covers and uh, if they ever do wind up coming with like original works like BTS has a ton of like solo work from guys like RM and uh, Suga, August D do all sorts of mixtapes. I, I save that kind of stuff for Fridays, but you guys have also been asking me to take a look at a bunch of different stages of theirs. Live performances, um, you know, a performance that shows for Countdown, for Mama and stuff. So I'm going to start checking out. You guys have sent me a couple pages worth of requests. So I'm going to start getting to them and knocking out like one a week or so. Of just kind of going back and checking out the stages because they do great stages and after watching kingdom legendary war i am really interested in seeing like how they put on more and more of their productions because they do a great job plus uh, this one in particular i'm gonna have to save it uh because uh the individual i don't think i saved the individual's name who asked me to who linked this to me let's see no i did not um but this does include a little bit of their world building is that right so i'm probably gonna have to save it because i'll go back and check it out the world building stuff anyways this is the answer comeback stage m countdown so and they did leave a little bit of note with that what was that yeah, come back stage for answer that's it come back stage perfect Subscribe. I'm still going to be doing plenty of AT's material, even though I'm all caught up with their discography. Like I said, I have a ton of uh, requests to get to from you guys, and that means I'm going to start Fever Road. So, if as long as Patre if Patreon, as long as YouTube is okay with me posting reactions to that up on YouTube, I'll be putting that up on YouTube. If not, it's got to go up on Patreon. I'm already reacting to uh salary lupin over there finishing up episode 10 of kingdom legendary war and i'll just keep adding more and more stuff over there there's all sorts of content but enough of that let's get started on the comeback stage we'll do the volume right about there let's see serious Sunghua. Okay, we got some holities. Interesting, nice. Are you evil? Okay, so I bet you this was... I know that there was all sorts of um, conflicting thoughts on what holities was when they first made a show as to whether or not they were like the dark evil concept and that kind of got disproven so i'm wondering if that is like this is when they were kind of clarifying some stuff about the world they were building i do like the smile though very nice <laughs> evil <laughs> nah Are you good? Ooh, nice questions back and forth. Dude, yeah. Already, like, you're, 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 you're the guys in black. The guys in black are traditionally the villains going back to old-timey mustache twirlers. Are you evil? Are you good? <laughs> Just because you ask somebody... That got deep. That got deep. Are you really good? Hmm?
The answer is... Turn the volume up. Ooh, that shaky gets in his hand. It takes a lot of control. Like this song. <laughs> oh, I would not be an eighties performance without aggressive hip thrusting. Raspy in the back. <laughs> I see a little Brad Pitt playing with the lip stuff going on. <laughs> in this one, dude. <laughs> And these guys are seriously good performers. Like, their dancing is on point. Their facial expressions. I mean, I do enjoy these live stages. I've, I've come to enjoy them more because, like, I, I was biased against stage performances because of, I'm used to U.S. concerts. And when a singing group, when a band gets on stage... They don't do this. <laughs> if you go for, like, a U.S. music group, I mean, I never liked going to concerts because they weren't interesting. I was just standing there watching someone sing, and it's like, dude, if I want... <laughs> Who cares? <laughs> this is so much more entertaining than... Yeah, I would actually go to a K-pop concert. I would be interested in that, and I would not say that of any other just 
general genre group anything you know so I have come to enjoy the stage performances is what I am saying because they actually perform on stage it's crazy it's crazy anyways I have uh I I don't I'm not gonna do more work today I my my brain yo I was doing taxes today and there is nothing to get me more like not wanting to do anything like throwing out a bunch of numbers and also it's taxes so I'm done I'm I'm done Oh, uh, you might not, I don't know, I'll try to record something ahead of time for Wednesday, but I'm not going to be around on Wednesday because I'm going to my grandma's house. Grandma's old. <laughs> when, when you're my age, your grandma's old, yo. Um, so I gotta, I'm helping taking care of her house. Grandma's house needs taking care of, so wish me luck. There's, um, mice. <laughs>